Yeah, but I, I like my name better than her. <gasps> Last name. Oh, <laughs> you, gotta, you gotta finish that, finish that thought. <laughs> I just wanted the... <gasps> she doesn't like her last name that much. But then at the same time, she doesn't like my last name that much either. Because I'm at the fucking end of the alphabet while she's all the way at the start. Are you, are you shushing me? Oh, Welcome back to Chin that's Strap Chaps. That's her fucking last name, isn't it? Chigash. Chigash. Chi gash. No, I call it. Shh, 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 shh. <laughs> if we're gonna go King of the Hill reference. Shh, 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 shh. Did you know? Shh, 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 shh. Oh, oh, oh! While I'm here, hold on. Is Russian for USA? Nope. It's not. So. All right, hold on. Give me this. I know, I'm wasting a fairy, but I don't care. Yeah, you. There's more fairies in this world. I know. Get that water, boy. No, not the water. I don't yeah. give a fuck about the get water. Get that poop, boy. No, the the quest where you gotta get all the Deku leave or trees or whatever mm -hmm. is fucking stupid. Um, <laughs> and it, it's not feasible to do until... Um, no, I want this right here. A firefly? Yeah, if you get the firefly. Forest firefly. It's not worth it to do because... Uh, or at least until you get the ability to fast travel. And we don't get that for a little while yet, so. Because you have to do... You get the water, and it's only good for so many minutes. And, and then you have to get more. So you basically have to do... You have to get all of the, the trees in one go, basically. So I think, like, for 30 minutes in-game time, like, that's how good the water is for. So you have to, like... Be able to fast travel. <laughs> letters for God, why? <laughs> God, why do I have to give a letter to this book? <clears throat> Dear God, why? <laughs> <laughs> if you are reading this letter, oh, okay. Yeah, whatever. Why can I do much? Wiggly, sniggly. Here's a wow. part piece. Wow. You have one of the few times that's actually useful. Holy shite. Whoops. <laughs> <laughs> little little father alert. Oh, my name is God Why. Well, God Why, <laughs> a little far. Alright, where are we going now? Hold on. Hold up. Where are we at? Alright, you want me to go here? I kind of want to go. Actually, no, never mind. We gotta go back to Windfall Island anyway. So I might as well go where I'm supposed to go, and then we go back to Windfall Island. Wait, never mind. <sighs> Billy. Hmm? Because I want to get the deluxe Picto box, and I want to get that picture of the orange girl and give it to the man, because I'm pretty sure they give me, like, a uh, heart container. Or a oh. piece of heart or something. Yeah. But, here's the deal. Here's the deal. Okay. Check this out. Is it laying on me? Yeah, that would give me one, dude. If I can get, even if it's a heart piece, they'd give me one. Mm-hmm. But, so here's here's what we gotta go. We gotta go over here, which is like the great something yeah. aisle or some shit. But it's surrounded by a storm. And we can't get the, uh, the pearl there. Okay. We have to go back to Windfall Island in order to get the bombs that we need because then we got to go to outside island to bomb a wall down to get the pearl right okay however when we go back to windfall island it's covered in rain and i don't think i can do that quest so do i do the quest first and then go there or do i just go there and then just do the normal shit i don't know ah uh. I mean, let's see, would it, if you do it the not, if you try to jump ahead, will it actually let you? That's not going to jump ahead question. necessarily, I just. I mean, technically you're, you're knowing what you have to do, so you are technically jumping ahead. Yeah, but I'm just saying like, I have to, because I have to do it in that order anyway, though, it's for, to progress the, the story. I'm just going to go to fucking Windfall Island, I'll clear out the squares along the way. Okay. And then I'll fucking. Whatever. 
Because I just want to get, like, the heart pieces and shit. Because it's cool. Look at it. <clears throat> There's obviously a lot of other side quests that we can do at, uh, um, at Windfall Island. But I want to get, I want to fucking clear out some of these squares anyway. So once we get to this square, I'm going to just go north, and then we'll... Yeah, and then you can just... Bill, you mean to tell me there's no other porno no, artists that you look at? No, actually. There aren't any? No. Bummer. There's no other porno. Because the only thing else I do is I read, like... Porno. Yeah, but manga, manga shit. Manga porn? Yeah, like, that's all I do when I look at porn. Manga porn? I don't, there's no artist or anything. So all I've been doing is, there's a lot of South Korean ones. Yeah. That I've been watching. And, I'll, like, I'll read those. Like, I have, like, seven different ones that I, I read weekly. And that's what I do for, for my porn now. Because, yeah, no, there's no artists that I watch that are you over gotta, here. You gotta do some digging. The main <laughs> reason why, because I have looked. Yeah. I have looked, but none of them have, like, a consistent place that I wish to be. Like, Shad had his place. Right. Shad base. I could just right, right. go there at any point in time. And there'd be something new. And he was constantly always drawing. Right. Everyone else does do that too. But then it's like on DeviantArt. Or it's on Twitter. Or it's like, on... It's on every other fucking yeah, platform. Yeah, Instagram or something. And I'm like... Because then you gotta I don't want it. any of these... I don't want to have... Another a fucking, fucking account for yeah. any of these things. Yeah, right. Can I just show up when I want to? Look at a back catalog... Be like, ah, oh, nice, yes, mm, great. I feel like you can do that on Twitter. I mean, you might, but I don't want to make a Twitter. Well, I'm saying you don't have, like, I don't think you have to make a Twitter to look at it, don't you? I believe... I don't know. I don't care. I believe the only thing you can do, because I've tried to look at Twitter to, like, read people's stuff before, and you can't sort it by media... So you wouldn't be able to find the pictures very have, quickly. Yeah, you have to, you have to make an everything. account for that. You'd yeah. have to actually scroll through their shit. And I don't want to. I don't care what the people have, like what they're talking about or anything like right. that. I just I'm here to look at things. Yeah, I get it. So it makes it hard. Like, yeah. I just don't. I don't care enough. Shad's got enough of a back catalog. You can just look at all that. I <laughs> I already looked at all of it before. <laughs> And then, like, Spaz Kid got into it a little bit, but he didn't post much. Yeah. And then some other guy was there, too. Oh, I don't think that's the right one. That's Fire Mountain, I think. Or maybe not. Maybe not. I don't know. Yeah, that's got to be Fire Mountain, I think. Yeah. All right, so. This one is empty because that's where, like, the Tower of the Gods comes from. So we have, we can skip that one. I don't know, man. I just look at porn sometimes, and that's it. <laughs> or maybe that's Dragon Roost. That might be Dragon Roost. Yeah. That's Dragon Roost over there. This right here is a fairy island. I might be able to go in it. I don't know. We'll see. What, what happened to the fairies? Why, why did, in all the newer games, they just get fucking gigantic and gross? I don't remember them in the newer ones, to be honest. <laughs> you, you don't remember in fucking um, uh, what's the what's the newest game? Uh, Breath of the Wild. Yeah, Breath of the Wild. You know how the, she's just remember. a fucking gigantic thing coming out of a tree. I don't remember. I like, don't remember a lot from that game, to be honest. <laughs> maybe if you're into giganticism porn, then like that might be up your alley. But well, the, I'm Resident, not. the Resident Evil lady, everybody was into her. Cause yeah, of but that's like a not that gigantic. Is that that is like tall lady, right? Tall lady. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's tall true. lady. That's true. That's true. And that's fine. It's the giganticism ones that are like, I'm so big, I'm going to shove your whole body in my pussy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Kind of thing. Oh, that's a thing. 
Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's hundred percent. Hundred percent. I think. But yeah, I'm I just saying know. that that is more niche than. No, I don't think I can do this one yet. Lady is tall. Yeah. And yeah. I want her to sit upon my face. I don't think I can do this one yet, but I, I will look. This one's got a rock in front of the thing, and I doubt there's any bombs on this island that would allow me to get in. Yeah, no. All right. I gotta do this other... See, this is the type of shit I'm talking about, where it's like... It's best to go and get the... Uh, gadgets and the items that you need in order to do these things, because I can't do it yet, obviously. No, I honestly don't remember a lot from Breath of the Wild because it felt very, uh... <sighs> I didn't like it, personally. I, I mean, I liked I've it. I've seen it. I liked it at first, but then it just got very old very quickly. Yeah. I much prefer an actual straightforward game. Like, I like that there are open world games. I don't like that everything's becoming open world. Yeah. Sometimes I want something more precise and concise. That's why I liked uh, Metro Exodus a lot, is because yeah, Metro's good because that game's I got have to like a, it. a game. That game's got a good balance. Did you ever finish it? No, I uh, I had to reinstall. Uh, yeah, reinstall, reinstall my yeah. Windows and everything, yeah. and it was on my Windows drive because the drive had died. Oh. So yeah, so now I bought the Redux version on yeah, yeah. Steam. Yeah, yeah. So I'm gonna play it on there. I think that Redux version really fucking won't chug your computer. It might chug my computer. I mean, I have. You probably have. You got a. I got a thirty eighty. So yeah, you got a better rig than I do. I, I got. I got some fucking nice tech. So I don't know if it could. I don't think this one can run it. And if it did, this one, yeah. yeah, this one can run it. Just not on like the enhanced one. Yeah. Yeah, you could even run it on the. I think I tried to, and it said just something. I'm like, whatever. <clears throat> you're gonna be playing it at 1080. Yeah. And probably low medium. Yeah. But the regular game looks fucking good anyway, so I don't yeah. really care. Because <laughs> this one, this one's my 1070. Yeah. Yeah. And that's what I would have played it on before. So yeah, you would have been fine. Because I played. Um, fucking hell, I played Last shit. Light. Yeah. And I even played Exodus on uh, on that guy. Yeah. (coughs) That 1070... I think I played Exodus on medium high. So the Redux version, yeah, you'd probably be on medium. That's probably where where I'm at, I think, yeah. I think part of it, too, is getting the right resolution. Because if it's too high, then it's like... Yeah, you'd definitely be 1080. Yeah. Like, I had played it at 1440, but you're you're on low at 1440, so it's not really worth it. Yeah. Now it's a good fucking game though, man. You should go back and play it. Yeah, it's I've, really I've been meaning freaking to. good. I'm surprised you haven't finished it yet. Yeah, well, like I said, the whole file got fucking destroyed because of it. But I got I got really into that game when I bought it, and I fucking <clears throat> loved it. Yeah, I well, got all the way up to the slaver part, and then oh. I had to stop. Well, the the thing I like about that game, though, the reason I brought it up when we were talking about open world shit is just because it's like... Uh, it's open world, but it's not. Yeah, it's like the, a pseudo open world. Yeah, it's a directed open world. Yeah, and that's what I like about it. Yes. Because it gives you that freedom, but it's not unlimited freedom to where you're just wandering around doing fucking nothing. Yeah. Breath of the Wild. <laughs> <laughs> like, that's what I mean. And like, you know what? My weapons don't fucking break. Yeah. After using it for three seconds... They can, they can get jammed though. Yes, the they guns can jam. get dirty and shit, which is yeah. which is cool. Like I don't know, I'm just yeah. There's just a lot of elements in Breath of the Wild that I wasn't a fan of. I, I liked the exploration. Like the exploration was really good, but like yeah. that was about it. See, I play the Metro games hard. Like yeah. I always play the Ranger hardcore that yeah, kind of right, stuff. Right. I play hardcore stuff because I want to get really immersed in it. Uh-huh. And uh, I had so much fun with Last Light. Because I played it on the hardest difficulty. Did I fucking get the song of passing? No, I haven't. Okay, I can get that too. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's the that is the cool way to do it, for sure. Yeah, look, I didn't know. <laughs> the problem with it is that I didn't feel like going in and looking to see how to do like secondary. So I played the whole game 
without knowing how to throw a knife yeah. or <laughs> yeah. like Molotov or anything like that. <laughs> so I played the whole game with just sneaking around, shooting normally. I, I never knew how to do the sneaking sections where you throw a knife and then do it. I had to like yeah, right. quickly go pop, pop kind of thing. Yeah, right, right. So I, I gave myself an even harder mode than I meant to. Hello. Hi. Here but uh, I had one really. You know, uh, have you played Last Light? Is that. Uh... That's the second one. Oh, yeah, no, I've played all of them. Okay, so. <clears throat> Get the fuck away from me, you bitches. Get the. F <laughs> you know when. Uh... You know when um, you're going uh, through, like, the radioactive area and. Uh, there's j the giant mantis shrimp that keeps like stalking you. Mm -hmm. Damn it. Get the fuck out of here. I had ran out of normal bullets. Yeah. So <clears throat> the way it ha ended up, like I was sh mid fight shooting it and all this, I was just fucking like. Because I, I ran out of air filters. Bef right before I saved, I had uh, uh, just ran out of air filters. So, I had to beat that boss, semi, you know, mini boss thingy, um, within the time of that last air filter that I had. Which I had no clue how much time I had left because I was playing Ranger Hardcore. Mm -hmm. I had no idea how many bullets I had left because I was playing Ranger Hardcore. Yeah. So I had to go in, and I realized halfway through the fight, I'm starting to... <gasps> yeah. Like, it's happening. I'm like, fuck, fuck. And then I run out of bullets. So then I have to go in and start using my money ammo. Yeah, your high and grade. I, yeah. yeah, my high grade ammo. And I have to fucking bring this guy down seconds before. And then I finally, I get past him. And then there's an air filter, and I... <gasps> Right before I fucking die, and then I had to keep on the game, and I'm low on ammo, and I'm using my high, uh, high caliber, rep weaponry and all that. And it's yeah, like, right. Oh, it made me. It, that made me feel like such. A, it was such a good game because of that kind of stuff. Yeah. <coughs> it's this on the fly type shit, and it's just like, it's so immersive, and I don't know. It. it, it for some reason, too, like, I don't know, just Exodus really, for me, like, put, like, that series, like, above, like, the other ones, like, in the series for me. Oh, yeah. Like, like Exodus. Like, Metro 2033 and, and Last Light are both good games, but just Exodus, I just think, had a lot more going on. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's kind of got some cliche-type moments in it, too, yeah. but, like, you know. Like, the whole cannibal colony that you go to and all that. Like, you know, it's kind of... I'm just sad that you don't get to see your wife's titties. I don't think you see your titties in the game. Yeah, not in the third one. In the second one you do. In the second one you do, yeah. And I'm like, Anna, you beautiful bitch. But she's got short hair in number three, so I take that over. Yeah. Seeing her titties, to be honest. <laughs> I like know, you beautiful stupid. bitch, t pull out, pull out, like, just when you're laying there, let one tit fall out. <laughs> That's what she did in the in the second one, basically. Yeah, just <laughs> let the tit fall out, let me stroke your slightly shaven head, and let me, like, fucking, you know, just play with it or something. Like, damn. Why are you teasing me so? Yeah. Like, you're laying on my lap and all that, and you're looking cute I know. as fuck, and I'm just like... <laughs> I know. <laughs> I know, but no. I know. <laughs> what I... happened? Why did that boy stand there for <laughs> hours on end? Yeah. Why am I in bed suddenly? What the <laughs> fuck? Oh my god. <laughs> Who changed me? I feel <laughs> finally. Who changed me? <laughs> Ain't no fucking kids in this fucking place. How fucking are you fucking? Get out of here, you fucking bitch. Hmm. Maybe I gotta wait till the next day. Maybe they're supposed to go on a date, so I probably gotta wait till daytime. <laughs> yeah, Metro's dope. I love it. Oh yeah. 
because the, the such a good game to like just get into. Yeah, because the first the first two games felt very similar to me, but like Exodus, like when you get to like the surface is like that's kind of a big revelation. I feel mm-hmm. at least for like you know the game, like the storyline and everything. So I that's what I really dug about it. The part I really was getting into is when um, the girl is holed up in the tower. And like throwing explosives and fire uh, shots down at the uh, the guys trying to advance on her. Uh huh. And then I'm just kind of like sneaking yeah, around the back, slowly, slowly killing them. And then I go down into the her bunker area and I unlock it all first. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Fucking dog, dude. Who are you barking at at fucking ten o'clock at night? <laughs> Some guy with a gun coming in. All right, but yeah, and then like uh, am I supposed to fight her out, buddy? Right now, do it right now. And then uh, I'll talk to her. Maybe tomorrow. <laughs> and then um, Come yeah, on, you and bitch. then you go and rescue her, What's and that? she's like that lady who's like, I got the fucking medicine and. <laughs> the oh, fucking medicine. Oh, yeah. and she she has a whole house up in the top of like this old lighthouse. You remember? Vaguely. Yeah, it's part of the Baron story. She like plants explosives and shit, and destroys his shit, and he's like, "I show you again." Ah, hey, buddy. Nice, oh, that's buddy. nice, buddy. <laughs> I will fuck you. <laughs> I forget I forget if they're in there at night or if they're in there in the day. I forget. Forget this shit. They're supposed to be in there though. I know I'm wasting a lot of time, but like this is a quest worth doing. Yeah, because you get a nice big old poopy at the end. Yeah, you do. You get a big old poopy. She just lays it down straight. She gets up on that table and she's like, <laughs> Yeah, I think they're in here during the daytime. Well. 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 Might even be where I just gotta go in somewhere while it's daytime and then they're in there. That might be it. Yeah. Let me try it again. Let me try her again, you know what I'm saying? Let me try her again. Come to think of it, there are a couple other things I can do here, but fuck it, I don't want to do it right now. <gasps> She's not there. They're in there now. Like, you can go into, like, the... the If you get the windmill going, you can uh, get into the upper part of the fucking Picto Box dude's oh, place. Oh, yeah. Actually, I remember that thing. should be a good... That is something I might want to do. Never hey, mind. little buddy. Hey, you little bitch. I'm gonna fuck her in the pussy today. Kinsey's gonna affect me in pussy. Yeah, see, why does she sound like that? That's <laughs> racist. <laughs> I don't know. I shouldn't have said it like that. I'm sorry, gentlemen and lady. Alright, bye. <laughs> <laughs> He's a bit slow. <laughs> Alright, let me, yeah, let me, let me, let me, uh, let me do it. Yeah, never mind. Let me light your chemicals. We'll do it Come later. Come on, uh, shimmin' lamb, blah, blah, blah. No, we'll do it later. Never mind. Down, I changed my mind. Ooh, yeah. Well, I'll do it later, because uh, once we get the fire arrows, we can light the thingy. Yeah. Also. What was the song that I always fucking sung? When... I'm trying to remember. Oh, yeah. Can you fuck me at the end? You take me to Taco Bell. <laughs> Can you fuck me in the ass? Can you take me to Taco Bell? Yeah. Is that the song? No, there was something else. Oh, I remember. What was remember the other one. song that I always sung when we were playing games? I don't fucking know. You sing a lot of songs. <laughs> <laughs> like, I don't know. That's like telling, asking me, like, which fart was my best one? Like, I don't know. Well, we have a whole thing, so, like, you could definitely pinpoint one. Yeah, but that's just a collection yeah. of a few, you know. That's one video. Most of them happen in like the same days. Well, there was one day. There was, there was one day where you straight up <laughs> dropped like 
20 of them. It was yeah, incredible. They, that's why they call me the old fart machine at work. I don't know who fucking calls you that, but... <laughs> Nobody, nobody calls me the old fart machine. Hey, fart machine, what's up? And then you're just like, excuse you. me, excuse me, okay? Do you watch my YouTube channel? That's the only way you would know about that. And she's like, yeah, dude, I've been subscribed since 2013. Let's do drugs and yolo. That's what I was saying. <laughs> that he was me. Us. That was us. me. Yeah. I'll never forgive him. Whatever. Oops, I got the wrong thing. And, and don't crane him. Do the crane train. I'm trying to think, like, it's... I remember vaguely we were playing... I think it was when we were playing Uncharted that I kept saying it. I don't know. I also anything? remember because uh, I think we were playing Metro at some point. And that's yeah, we did play Metro for a little bit. For a hot minute, we did. Yeah. I, uh, I can't remember. Yeah, I feel yeah. like it might be that one that I was saying, but then there was another one that I sung all the time. How does that work? There's no wave that's kicking up. <laughs> no, I don't know. What is this fucking the Flintstones where you can like put your feet through the ground? See. After seeing a game like Sea of Thieves, I feel like uh, that's a good game. I, like I that feel game. like if they made a Zelda game in that fashion again with the water and shit, like it could be fucking killer. Yeah, It'd be sick, man. Rare made that game. I know. Not the same Rare, but Rare. <sighs> you suck. Just fucking like skip it, dude. Oh, <laughs> this is dangerous. I shouldn't be doing this. It's just a fucking tornado, dude. No, so. if I get caught in it, then I'm fucked. He's gonna he's gonna teleport me to some other fucking random place. Mm, I don't think I should go closer. Why do you have to be right there? <laughs> I want to get the fish, but he's like right like at the threshold of like that fucking thing. That you know? thing's pretty far away. But it ropes you in if you get too close. All right, here we go. Because there's nothing I can do against it. If I get pulled into it, then I'm, like, getting thrown somewhere. And what usually... If conveniently, it's nice. I'm next to the place you need to be. I'm sure that's a speedrunning strat. It probably won't be that way. <laughs> it's probably a terrible speedrunning strat, but it's probably a strat. There's probably something that dictates where it'll send you, but, like, I don't know what it is. What were we saying? I was trying to think of the song. Think of the song that we were saying? Yeah. Oh. Beats me, bitch. <laughs> oh, yeah. No, I think like a, if they did like a, a Zelda game with like the Sea of Thieves kind of appearance and shit, I think it'd be pretty cool. Because I like this. Like, this works. Like, this is fine. But it's like, you know, if you were able to create a game that had this sense of exploration and everything with more realistic graphics and shit. Yeah. Like, ooh, it would be really cool. Yeah. Get me a 4K Zelda where, like, he's got stubble, he's got an eye patch. Um, That's a special still, beetle over there. Still wearing, like, the tunic and all that. And then, like... Oh, Big crashing waves, huge storms that you gotta like yeah. get your little ship going through. Yeah, dude, like that would be sick, yeah, like, man. Like fucking Sea of Thieves, but but Zelda. Yeah, and I really like Sea of Thieves. Sea of like, Thieves looks if cool. Sea of Thieves had Zelda esque things, like yeah, an actual story to go around, not just. Yeah. If it was a single player game, yeah, that that's actually really, had like a story and NPCs and stuff like that, then it would be a super awesome game. That's really where I'm at with it. Like that's how I felt when I played um, Ark Survival. Like I kind of don't like that there's like no real story or anything. You just kind of survive. Maybe there is a story. I just never got far enough in it. But 
there's like a certain degree of for me of like where a game like just kind of leaves it to you to figure its shit out. Like, there's a fine line between being like too much and too little. You know what I mean? Yeah. There's a bird there. I did not want to fly by the bird. Um, and that's sometimes like those survival games are kind of like that for me. Like, Subnautica is good. I like it. It scares the shit out of me. <laughs> yeah. I tried it. I'm, like, I, I can't. I tried to get Ian to join me in it yeah. since I have it. I can't play that game for very much time because it's like. Because farming the shit to get the shit, like, is, it takes way too fucking long. And if you, if you lose, like, your. Cyclops or whatever, like good. F I'm not gonna fucking try and get another one. Yeah. <laughs> like it's too much time. I believe the game is multiplayer now. Yeah, and that's where I'm trying to get Anne to do it with me, but she is Fuse. terrified. It's fucking scary. <laughs> yeah, she's like, and no. it's and it's not even like I'd be alone most of the time doing all the stuff, and she'd be just gathering everything in the shadows. Like, and it's not even so much that the monsters are scary, it's just the prospect of being in this fucking ocean. Because when you're in the, the Cyclops, you're like in the cockpit, and it's all just a big window. <laughs> and yeah. I'm like, I hate that. Yeah. I hate it. Because everything's just like... <sighs> it's there. At any point in time. At any point in time. And part of it is, too, is like you can't like really easily see... I mean, it's intentionally designed that way but like you can't really like intentionally or like you can't really see super well around you when you're in the cockpit unless you use like the external cameras it's a lot to manage and it's like i fucking hate it <laughs> <laughs> it's really what i'm telling you see i love those kind of games where you gather resources you do stuff like i played you know like a thousand hours of arc right I only played a little bit, and it's like, I like, I think the concept is nice, but I think there's, like, there is such a big, like, learning curve, maybe, like, oh, yeah. kind of there's a learning a, curve. There's a learning curve, definitely. If you don't know what to do, you die constantly. Yeah, and I think if that's If you don't know what, what's good or what's bad, you die constantly. Yeah, and I think that's kind of what's frustrating to me, but that is also part of the game experience, as, like, yes. learning the shit. It would be a so terrible game it. if there was no respawning. Yeah. Because you would constantly die and no one would get anywhere except for the really hardcore people who just keep remaking yeah. new characters yep, and yep, learning. Yep. Which, sometimes I am like that, sometimes I'm not. Yeah. But, yeah, that game is a lot of fun. 98% of that game I have spent on the land. Oh, or yes. in the air. Or, of course. Yeah. I am not a sea person for that. Yeah. One, because it's kind of janky. The whole up and down thing doesn't feel as great when you're in it. And uh, I don't like to look down and see a fucking Megalodon coming straight up at me. <laughs> is, that Just don't... is that what happens in the game? Oh, yeah, constantly. Oh, dude, that sounds that sounds cool. I would like to watch that. <laughs> like, I'll look it up later. It's fun, but megalodons have such a large aggro range oh yeah when you're in the water so oh, you'll just be swimming you'll naturally. be you'll be like oh i can probably get to that and then you'll look to your right and then there's just this fucking shark coming right at you or sometimes it's a fucking giant crocodile dude can you pull up a clip of that i want to see that next time on chin strap chaps we watch fucking arc in a megalodon yeah.